we are probably the first generation of people to have grown up where video games played an important role in our childhood. You know, I'm, I, I'm into video games because I like video games and I play video games all the time and I grew up playing video games. When you have been addicted to something, especially when you were a kid, the desire to try and like do it yourself, to make your own, is really compelling. It's like, yeah, I wanna, I wanna be in control of that. If you grow up with something, you're gonna, if it's a part of your everyday life, you're gonna make art about it. When you hear a certain kind of 8-bit sound, for a certain generation of people, that will evoke childhood. And so when an artist uses that, now it has all this meaning invested in it. Certainly the narrative that the media sells us is a timeline of progress that starts with the 8-bit and gradually winds up with the movie Final Fantasy. At every part along that timeline, you could have had offshoots to, to just concentrate on one aspect of the technology. It's just that we haven't really had time to explore those paths. I am fascinated with the technology, I always have been. But I'm also very cautious of what this technology means and how we, how we perceive it and how we use it has to be interrogated.